Well, this morning, Madeline and I are going to do something that we've never done before. And that's where we're going to get on a boat, we're going to the middle of the ocean into a crater, and we're going to snorkel. So we're heading over to the boat right now, and we've really been looking forward to this. This is one of the big activities that we're going to do on this trip, and I'm pretty excited. Well, I am on board the Calypso. I've got my reef safe sunscreen on. It's kind of like a white chalk, but uh, behind me is Maui. And we are probably a half hour away from Molokini Crater, which is where we're heading first. There's a very rare monk seal here today. Which is pretty exciting. Uh, like you know what they love to eat? The same well, area to die we're about to go in the area. Well, here we are in the crater. Snorkeling was tons of fun. Am I good? You're free to fly. Alrighty. Well, we had about an awesome hour and a half here in the Molokini Crater, and uh, now we're gonna be heading to an area called Turtle Town. It's supposed to be a lot of sea turtles over there. Got to see the seal here, that was really cool. And uh, what an experience. This is the backside of Molokini Crater. It was once used as a military test site.
We are in Turtle Town swimming with these sea turtles. We've seen so many. It is amazing. It's been We've turtle. seen so many. They've been swimming right underneath us. It's it's incredible. What a great experience in Turtle Town. I saw so many turtles. I could have done that all day. Well, we're back on the boat. We had a ton of fun. And uh, we're gonna keep rolling here now we want to get back on land. It's our uh, last full day here. And, uh, I could have stayed in Turtle Town all day. After an incredible morning of snorkeling, we have worked up a hunger. So we're heading over back to Lahaina. We're gonna get some ice cream, some craft beer, and some dinner. This is our last night in Maui, and it's gonna be hard to leave. We have so much to look forward to. We're going on to the big island. We're going to Oahu. But Maui has set the bar high for our first stop in Hawaii. So tonight in Maui, we want to go a little more low-key. So we went to a fish market that also serves hot food. I got a Ono burger. It's 100% ground Ono, which is another fish I haven't tried yet. I'm excited to try it in a burger form. Madeline got two tacos. She got a Baja fish taco and a Kahlua pork taco. They both look really good and we're going to kind of split everything. So we're looking forward to it. All right, I'm gonna dig right into the Ono burger. It's got lettuce on it. <laughs> it's got sauce on it. It's got some grilled onions on the bottom. Oh yeah, that's that. good. Looks kind of like a turkey burger. Mm, it's very mild. In fact, for most people, if you told them this wasn't fish, they probably wouldn't even know it. But I like it. I think this might not be my last Ono burger on island. That is very good. There's a lot of pork on here. It's shredded. And, um, I thought we were going to eat a lot of pork here in Hawaii, but we really haven't. I'm really glad that I opted for this tonight. Mm. Oh, got me. Baja fish taco. Fried mahi, it was super crispy, pico, and then the sauce came on the side here. It's really good. I'm not sure what it is, but the sauces have been on point since we've been in Hawaii, I have to say. And we haven't had a fried fish taco yet, so mixing it up again. This is a great spot. Well, the fish market was absolutely delicious. Love the tacos. The Ono burger was a huge hit. It's gonna be tough to top. Well, you know that we absolutely love visiting local independently owned craft breweries. It's the Red Sand Amber, which I'm guessing is a nod to Haleakala National Park. Up in that crater, you got a lot of red skin. We'll see how it is. Oh. So this baby beach blonde ale. It goes down really, really easy. And it's very refreshing. I haven't picked up surfing yet, but I can envision a long day of being out on the water, 
which we were out on the water today. We were snorkeling. Not quite as cool as surfing, but you know, we saw some turtles, so that was fun. But this goes down easy. Wish they'd bottle that up and send it back to the mainland. We are at Ululani's and we are getting shaved ice. We got coconut, guava, and passion fruit, and it also has macadamia nut ice cream on the bottom. First shaved ice in Hawaii. I'm gonna get all the flavors, go right in. Mm. When you get a Thai or a Hawaiian ice at home, it's like chunky, and it's got a very syrupy topping to it. Which was different. If you want to see more from our adventures in Maui, click right here. And don't forget to subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one.